You know, one of the things we've been doing here at uh, Trinity College Queensland is just taking some time to talk to folks about books that have been influential for us and books that we use when we teach uh, here at the college. And so one of those books that I know that Paul Jones has used and now that I'm using in a class called From Text to Sermon, which is a look at Thessalonians and preaching Thessalonians and also interpreting Thessalonians. One of those books has been Biblical Preaching by Haddon Robinson. And this is a book um, that will help you not only become a better preacher and a better communicator, but also a better writer. Essentially what the book does is teach you how to go from presenting a multitude of ideas in a 15 to 20 minute sermon or talk to presenting one major key theme that you derive from the biblical text and then apply and explain to the modern contemporary setting which we find ourselves in. And the effect of that is that instead of giving people all these little factoids that then hang together or don't hang together actually, you give them one thing that they can chew on and walk away with. And you learn how to state it and say it and explain it in a memorable way. Now one of the reasons that uh, I love using this book is because I actually got to take a class with Haddon Robinson uh, when he was teaching at a seminary that I went to in Massachusetts in the United States. Um, and this was a time when I had never preached in my life and I was actually terrified to preach. And Haddon's presence was so powerful that I was almost afraid to speak in class, although he, he was a, a gentle person and a very um, competent and skilled teacher. Um, I remember that one time he had me, uh, he just said, hey, you in the front row, tell me John 3.16. And he wanted to hear how I said it, how I, uh, how I communicated it, but I totally forgot John 3.16, which was quite embarrassing because it's one of the most popular verses in the Bible that basically everyone in the world knows. But that just illustrated for me that when you study the, the, the skill of preaching and the task of preaching, it's intimidating. And many people think I'll never be able to be comfortable in, to, in preaching or even to enjoy preaching. But one of the things I've learned through this book is a way of preaching that is not only comfortable, but that's enjoyable. That allows you to so focus on the key aspects of a text that you don't have to sit there with a manuscript and read it for 20 minutes. You can actually embody that, write it out, and then go into the pulpit or in front of the classroom with no notes and deliver that message with conviction and power, which is, I think, the exact way that we need to talk to people about the gospel and about uh, the Christian faith. People um, aren't interested in being read a, a laundry list of ethical ideas or uh, even a, a really interesting lecture on a Sunday morning. That's really what we're supposed to be doing in the classroom. Uh, what people are, are needing in this time, especially in our post-Christian culture, are men and women to speak clearly about what the Word of God says, but to speak it not only as a set of ideas to them, but to speak it as uh, something that changes their individual lives and their communal life now and the present. It's, it's less about talking to people about the Bible when we preach and more about talking to people about themselves from the Bible. And that's one of the things that I've learned from this, and I would highly recommend it to you. Biblical Preaching by Haddon Robinson.